Hello. My name is Chambu. Ruth. And today, we're uh, today's topic is about a child is born. Na neno la siku ya leo ni mwana hazaliwa. What does a child mean? Mtoto anamaanisha nini kwako ama mwana anamaanisha nini kwako? A child is a human being. Mtoto ni kiumbe below the age of 18. Ambaye yuko chini ya miaka 18. A child is a gift to the family. Mtoto ni zawadi kwa familia. A child is innocent. Mtoto ni mkamilifu. A child is a blessing. Mtoto ni baraka. A child is a blessing to everybody. Na mtoto ni baraka kwa wote. There is a child that is different to everybody. Kuna ule mtoto ambaye sio wa kawaida. That child is named Jesus. Na huyo mtoto anaitwa Yesu. May you please flick to the chapter Isaiah chapter 4 verse Tafungua kitabu cha Isaya sura 4 mstari wa 6. Isaya 4:6. Kama msomaji amepata naweza kutusomea. Isaya ine na mstari wa sita tunasema hivi kwa jina la Yesu Kristo Amen Kisha kutakuwa na hema kuu uvuli wakati wa mchana kwa sababu ya hari na kuwa makali pa kukimbilia na kujificha wakati wa tufani na mvua Sorry sorry to me. Yeah, Isaiah chapter 9 verse 6. Chapter 9:66 inasema hivi. Maana kwa ajili yetu mtoto amezaliwa. Tumepewa mtoto mwanamume na uweza wa kifalme utakuwa begani mwake. Naye ataitwa jina lake mshauri wa ajabu. Mungu mwenye nguvu baba wa milele mfalme wa amani amen. Can I read in English Isaiah chapter 9 verse 6 says A child will be born to us a son will be given to us he will rule over us and he will be called wonderful advisor and mighty god he will also be called father who lives forever and prince who brings peace amen. Amen. So a child will be born to us mtoto atazaliwa kwa ajili yetu that means inamaanisha a blessing will be part of another family baraka zitakuja kwenye familia hii it will be a blessing to jesus's family itakuwa baraka kwa familia ya kristo the reason why he's different to the other children na sababu ya yeye kukuwa kitofauti na wengine watoto because when he was born sababu wakati alipozaliwa there was a giant star kulikuwa ni nyota kubwa up in the sky you do kwenye mawingu for everyone to see and for everyone to praise kwa kila mtu kuiona na kila mtu kuisifu a son will be given to us mwana atapewa kwa ajili yetu that means inamaanisha the angels have already told jesus kwamba malaika walikuwa wakimwambia yesu tayari that they're going to have a blessed son. Kwamba wata, watapewa mtoto ambaye amebarikiwa. A holy son. Mtakatifu, mtoto mtakatifu. Jesus. Ambaye ni Yesu Kristo. He will rule over us. Atatawala na kututawala sote. This means inamaanisha that, that he will be our leader. Kwamba atakuwa ni kiongozi wetu and our guider. Na atakuwa vile vile ni wakutuonesha njia. and he will be called na ataitwa wonderful advisor and mighty god mshauri mwema na mungu mwenye nguvu he will guide us into protection atatuelekeza atatu kwenye ukingo wake think of us as refugees uh, ujifikirie kama vile mkimbizi 
He will look after us and he will guide us in the right way. Atatupigania na kutuongoza kwenye njia njema. He will also be called Father who lives forever. Ataitwa vile vile Mungu anayeishi milele. Jesus and God will never leave you. Yesu pamoja na Mungu hawatawahi kukuacha. And the prince who brings peace. Anaitwa vile vile mfalme wa amani. Jesus is the prince of peace. Yesu ndiye mfalme wa amani. Call upon his name and he will remove all your stress from your life. Muite na atatoa yote ambayo ni matatizo kwenye maisha yako. Jesus is a king and a prince at the same time. Yeye ni mfalme tena ni mwana wa mfalme vile vile. He rules over children and adults. Anatawala watoto na wakubwa vile vile. While being a child himself. Na hata kama yeye mwenyewe ni mtoto. If you need a ruler, kama unataka kiongozi, call upon Jesus. Muite Yesu. He is a king and if you need peace, yeye ni mfalme na kama unahitaji amani muite Yesu tu yeye ndiye mfalme wa amani He will look after you while you're in danger Atakupigania ukiwa kwenye matatizo He will protect you from your sicknesses Atakupigania kwenye magonjwa He will bring peace to your life Ataleta amani kwenye uzima wako He will bring children in your life as well. Ataleta vile vile watoto kwenye uzima wako. Thank you. Amen. Hallelujah. Yes, hallelujah. Amen. That was powerful. God bless you. Did you hear a revelation? Ulisikia hiyo ufunuo? A king or a sometime a prince. Yeye ni mfalme tena ni mwana wa mfalme. Did you get it? Unaelewa hiyo? Wow. Father, I thank you for Ruth. Can I have my oil, please? Bring me my oil. Hallelujah. Ruth, I'm going to anoint you with oil, yeah? yeah. I, I didn't give you that gift. You already got it, yeah? Look at this community here. Angalia tu watu ambao wanaikaa hapa mbele yako. It's not easy to stand with all the people. Sio rahisi kusimama na kuongea na watu wengi kama hawa. So you did it. Alright? Ameifanya. And the Bible says it's not by our might. Na Biblia inasema sio kwa nguvu zetu. But it's by his spirit. Lakini kwa nguvu za Roho Mtakatifu. The Holy Spirit fill you more. Tutamuomba Roho Mtakatifu amjaze zaidi. Yeah. As Amen. you grow. Ukikomaa May this gospel that we preach today continue to fill you so you have more to give to others. If, if you are okay with that, say, just say yes. Yes. Amen. No. Can I call all the pastors? We're going to pray for this. this. Big, uh, big evangelist. Who is coming in the next few years? Don't kneel down, kneel down if you can, please. Yes. Anatena majabu. You choose who you want. You never ask a human what you want to do. 
You are a mighty God. You don't need our advice to do what you want to do. And this one, Lord, you have chosen her. Father, I am not her. With such a gift that you already put in her, Lord. That she may be filled by your spirit. May this gospel be filled in her mouth as a full package that she have enough for her and for all those around her. May she stand to preach the gospel in truth, Lord. I pray that she is filled now. By your spirit, the spirit of God. Lord, we anoint her. We command that this gift grows. That no one shall come in her way to stop it. No environment shall come to stop it. No friend shall come to stop it. Let her rise down for the sake of your own glory. We thank you, Jesus. We thank you, Father, King and Prince. Yes, 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 yes. Amen. Hallelujah, church. Amen. Hallelujah, church. Amen. God is good. All the time. All the time. God is good. And that's his nature. Thank you, Ruth, for the preaching. Asante Ruth kwa maubiri ya siku ya leo. And we're gonna hear more of God's word. Tutendelea kusikia menje kutoka kwa Mungu. We are going to welcome Sunday school to tell us the verses. Tutawaita wale ambao wamepangwa kutoa verses. Hallelujah. 